This is daily reflection on the lives of the saints. March 15, Saint Louise de Marillac, widow. Louise de Marillac was educated by the Dominican nuns at Poise. She desired to become a nun, but on the advice of her confessor, she married Antony Legras, an official in the Queen's service, in 1613. After Antony's death in 1625, she met Saint Vincent de Paul, who became her spiritual advisor. She devoted the rest of her life to working with him. She helped direct his ladies of charity in their work of caring for the sick, the poor, and the neglected. In 1633, she set up a training center, of which she was directress in her own home for candidates seeking to help in her work. This was the beginning of the Sisters of Charity of Saint Vincent de Paul. She took her vows in 1634 and attracted great numbers of candidates. She wrote a rule for the community and in 1642 Vincent allowed four of the members to take vows. Former approval placed the community under Vincent and his congregation of the missions with Louise Aspirio. She traveled all over France, establishing her sisters in hospitals, orphanages, and other institutions. By the time of her death, in Paris on March 15, the congregation had more than 40 houses in France. Since then, they have spread all over the world. She was canonized by Pope Pius XI in 1934 and was declared patroness of social workers by Pope John the 23rd, in 1960. Her feast day is today, March 15th. Reflection Be diligent in serving the poor. Love the poor. Honor them, my children, as you would honor Christ himself. Saint Louise de Marillac.